All right, you guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And, you know, just check me out. I have tons of videos. And I just want you guys to comment more. Because I can see y'all looking. I can see y'all peeking, but y'all not speaking. You know what I mean? So, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and everything, and all that, and all that. So, we're going to get into the story. This is going to be about the time I almost got started in Cabo. So... We get off the ship at about seven. I want to say like seven or eight o'clock in the morning. I, I feel like it was like seven for real because we had to be at a certain area in like 45 minutes into Cabo to, you know, get to our um excursion or whatever we're uh, riding camels and shit so we're trying to get to our excursion on the last day the last tender we are we seeing it all over the all over the ship we're seeing it all over the ship all over the ship and it's funny because we get up at like six o'clock in the morning and we we make it to the tender to get us into Cabo. Then we, you know, ride out to we ride out to the Well, we had to wait. We had to find the locate the pickup spot. First, we had to find a pickup spot. I'm sorry, let me back up. We had to find a pickup spot. And that took us a minute because we had to reread the directions and find the pickup location. And it was like pick up in front of the OXXO store. So we had to basically like walk around and look for the OXXO store. OXXO. OXXO. I'm going to put a picture if I can find one. So we looking for the store and we finally find the store. Perfect. So we're sitting there and we have to be there at a certain time. So we had a, we were early. We had a little bit of time. So let me say this again. We're in Cabo San Lucas and we got there on a cruise ship. We landed, we on a cruise ship, we, and we're doing our excursion. I think we went back to like the dock to get some water or something and then we went right back to the pickup location so maybe like 10 to 15 minutes went past and the pickup van came to pick us up. It was, um, I want to say like, damn, I think it was like Wild Canyon or something like that. 
like wild county and something. I don't have my phone right now to check, but I think it was like Wild Canyon or something like that. This, okay. This shit is spicy. This is the Diablo three times spicy, spicy, spicy <laughs> crab leg and crawfish, shrimp, all the shit, you know. With the sauce and shit. This is like the spiciest sauce they make. I'm assuming. Because I would have ordered the spiciest one. But this is the spicy sauce. This shit is hot. But it's really good. Okay, so the van come and picks us up and it's not just us riding, so it's us and it was already people in the van. So it was like a couple in the van and then it was a guy and his two kids or I'm assuming they're his two kids. It was a guy with two children. They, I don't know if that's his kids or what, so. That was guy and the kids or whatever. And later on, I found out that the guy with the kids, <clears throat> they were on the same um, ship as, as, we were also on that, on that ship. You know, we were on the ship too. So I found out that they were on the ship. So that was ironic, I guess. I don't know. Okay. So, um, yeah. So we um, get on the, the, the van and... Okay, so we get in the van and the couple in front of us that was sit sitting right in front of us in the front seat of the van, we sat like directly behind them and then the guy and the kids were sitting all the way in the back of the van. It was like a big van, like, and with the door, you know, the sliding door, like, the big van with the sliding door. So, so, we get in the van, and they just get to talk, okay, so, but when they first opened the van, the lady was like, oh my god, I saw you, I can feel your energy, and I really like that, you're high, like, oh, I like that. And I was like, okay. And um I didn't I wasn't mad about that. Like what? Like, okay. I was like, okay, thanks, cool, you know. <laughs> like I wasn't like dishing it out for y'all, but I guess I was. But um then she just got to chatting it up. They chatting it up. Not okay. Everybody's talking. And I'm like, okay. And I'm not trying to get mad about. I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad about it. Definitely not mad about it. But I'm just like, all right now, I'm like, okay. But I never stopped it. I never said nothing about it because I didn't want to give that like that feeling like that I was like pissed or anything because I wasn't mad but I was just like okay damn like you know okay you know okay okay <laughs> like but whatever I was kind of irritated like shut the fuck up like shut the fuck up. 
But anyway, we get to our destination. We got to wait. We got, okay, mind you, we have to be back on the ship at 12 o'clock. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm saying that wrong. We have to be back at the dock at 12 o'clock because that's the last tender going back to the ship. That's the last tender going back to the ship. The ship is not docked on to, you know, the island or wherever. I'm saying island. What the fuck? I'm so dumb. It's not docked on to the land. You know what I'm saying? So we have to take a tender from the land onto our ship. Let's get into these probably because I'm day clean. So we have to take a tender onto the ship. So we got to be there around 12 o'clock. We finally get to our destination. Man. Oh, snap. We finally get to our destination and. It's a, like a fucking line. Everybody over there. There's a lot of people there. And shit, it's not looking good. It's a line. Who likes line? Nobody likes lines when you're on a deadline. When you got a certain time to do shit, you got to manage your time for real. You really do. You really fucking do. So we get there and... We get there. Oh snap. Oh snap. We get there at the line. We get through the line. All that, all that. Then we have to take another van up to where the camels are located. We have to take another van up to where the camels are located because they're not like right there on the side of the fucking thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, they have they have all ton all sorts of activities at this place. They have like um they have like a like a zoo type thing going on. They had ATVs. You could ride all up and down everywhere. They had ATVs. They had um, the camel ride. And um, I think they had something else, but I, mean, I can't really remember off the top of my head. Yeah. But they had um, they had a lot of little stuff. Look at y'all. Look at that shit. Get that shit up in this sauce. Just put on there like that. Mmm. Okay. So yeah, we get there, we get through the line, we get into another van to get to where the camels are. We finally get to where the camels are. I'm checking the time the whole way because Okay, we left out at like seven, but damn, like I'm still checking the time. Like we got we crunch for time for real. And thank God he wasn't panicking like I was because we would have got left for real because he really came through with shit. Like he came through 
with under pressure, like he was able to handle my anxiety and just me being all like paranoid and shit. Thank God I have my password. My password. Thank God I have my passport on me. I didn't have nothing else. I left my phone. And I think I only had like $30 on me. For real. I think I have my... I left my phone and I left my wallet, my car, my credit cards, my cards and all that shit. And all I had was like $30 and my passport. Not my password. Oh my God. My passport. So. I'm irritated because I don't got my phone. And my, I'm the one that left it. I didn't, you know, I'm not mad with him. But I'm irritated. And I'm probably giving him some shade or whatever you know like oh my god what's going on like you know so we end up okay i'm i'm kind of jumping through it so um we we get to the camels we up there with the camels and it was fun it was so fun we ride the camels we they really put us on the camels right away basically Get us on the cameras right away. Oh, this shit is spicy, baby. Around the camels, and I want to maybe like the day before we rode the dolphin, and they didn't allow us to take pictures. We couldn't bring our phone or nothing, so we paid a good a good amount of money. To um, get the footage to get the pictures of the um, you know the ride, and we was already running late, so I didn't really want to do. It. We couldn't. We didn't have time to go look at the pictures, get the estimate, and look at our everything. So we didn't get that. We didn't have time. We didn't have time to do that all that. So we didn't do that. So I'm telling them, I'm telling my, I'm telling them like, um, I'm telling them, give me your phone. Cause I don't have my phone. I don't have bring my phone. If I had my phone, I would've got all that shit. Oh my grabber. Yeah, but um, I didn't have my phone. So. Sure, I got all that shit out. Stop him. Rapper. But, um, yeah, so I'm like, give me your phone. Because my dad ain't on my phone. He like, no, I ain't trying to get in trouble because <laughs> you trying to record us and they charge it. <laughs> Let me use some of this on pepper. This shit is just here. I don't know. I'm going to try it. They just sprinkled our shit on. Boop out. Boop out. Okay. Dip that bitch. Sprinkle that shit. Okay. Let me, let me know again. Let's see what's going on with that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, yeah. So, he like, nah, I ain't giving you the phone. He don't want to give me the phone. 
He don't want to give me the phone. Because I'm like, let me be going. <laughs> I would have recorded my shit. <laughs> So, um, he didn't give me the phone, and it was a cool little ride, um, I, a camel, I was com more comfortable with the, with the camel, for real, I was more comfortable with the camel than I was with the dolphin. But I still had a great time both ways. Like I had a good time with the dolphin. I had a good time with Kim. So you know, but <laughs> but um after we rode the camel, I'm checking the I keep checking the time. I keep checking the time. They did like a little demonstration. Not okay. They did like a little show. What should I call it? I don't know. They had the camel, camel doing like another camel doing like tricks and shit. Whatever, whatever. Entertaining people and shit. What the fuck? But, but um, yeah. They did the little show or like they got the camel doing shit or whatever and. I'm checking the time. I'm like, it's time to go, for real. Where is the van at? Because the excursion was like, it was, initially it was supposed to be like two hours. But we were rushing the whole thing. Like, we missed the whole hour of the excursion. Like, we weren't even able to do, like, the full two hours. I guess they were just going to let us ride it for, like, an hour or 30 minutes for real because that was all it was. And then, like, go over and touch them and pet them and all that bullshit. shit. But, I mean, I feel like, shit, since we didn't get the two hours, shit, you better record what you can. Like, what the fuck? Record what you can. And for real, he only started recording because the lady, it was another couple there that came. Like after we were already done riding camels and sitting down, looking at the like camel show or whatever they were doing. Like, like you know, like how they make them do kiss people or just, you know, like the little, you know, close up and personal show. The lady, a lady started recording. And I was like, pull your phone out. Let me get, you know, what I need. And he did or whatever. But that shit was crazy. That shit was crazy. That shit was crazy. Oh, for real. I got as much footage as I can get. Um, I'm looking for the van. Like, I'm ready. We gotta go back. We gotta take two. We gotta take two cars, really, for real. two. We gotta take two trips, for real. So we gotta get back to the check-in, like station, like where we came in and got our tickets and got our wristbands and shit. We gotta get back right there. Then we have to drive forty-five minutes back. To back to the um, deck or the t you know back to the tender whatever. So we get the van. The van finally comes, 
and we um get in the bath and we see okay it's funny because we see the dude like we get back to the um, entrance And before we even went out to rock the camels, we were talking about an Uber. We were talking about an Uber like they said that they were going to um, call an Uber for us so that we can um, get back to the ship on time or whatever. We get back there, no Uber is called. No Uber is called. Nobody called the Uber. Nobody called the Uber. Okay. I don't got my phone. All I got is thirty dollars, and nobody called the Uber. Nobody called. All my stuff is on the ship. I'm dreaming about the ship because I can't really see. I can't see the ship from how far. We were forty five minutes in the Cabo. I couldn't see nothing. Forty five minutes in the Cabo. Couldn't see nothing. So. Yeah, so we sitting there waiting. He had to eventually like download the damn app so that we could um get a uh, Uber. We he had to download the app so that we can get an Uber. It's like ten. I'm telling you, y'all. I'm telling y'all, it was like 10 30. He d we gotta be there. No way. It's not 10 30. It's not because we were conched. It was like 11 30. And we had to be at the ship. I mean, we had to be at the dock. We had to be at the tender. Excuse me, I'm sorry. We had to be at the tender by 12 o'clock because that was the last tender going back to the ship. So. It's like 11.30, he calling the Uber, the Uber is on the, he, he getting in touch with the Uber, the Uber is on the way. Once the Uber gets there, no way, let me back up. Because the kids, they got, they called the Uber for them. It's funny, because I was kind of mad, because the, um, the place, they called the Uber for the other, the other party, like the kid, the dude with the two kids, they called an Uber for them, but they, they didn't call an Uber for us. And I wasn't getting mad, like, what the fuck, like, what's wrong with them? And he just like, calm down, calm down, you know? So I'm trying not to be irritated, but I am definitely irritated. So 
our Uber driver finally comes. Finally, finally comes. It's like we got like we barely we have a barely a few minutes to get there. And it takes us a few minutes. It takes us that much time to get there, basically. Like, it takes us a few minutes to get there. We got a few minutes to get there. It takes us a few minutes to get there. Like, we barely made it, for real. So, he trying to drop us off downtown where all the tourists is at. We would have never made it if he dropped us off downtown. So, we like, nah, take us all the way. Take us all the way. So, So he takes us all the way. And we run into the damn tender and shit. We basically run into the tender because by this time it's 11.59, okay? I know I probably got the times wrong, but it was late, like, it was, uh, when he made it back, it was like 11.59 for real. And I was happy to be back on that boat, for real, because I wasn't trying to get left in Cabo. All I had was $30, like, oh my God, I don't have my phone, like, oh my God, it's going to be a lot. It's going to be a lot of work. That was going to be a lot of work. I'm not done, y'all. One time, another story time. Because I'm not done. I still got food. I'm not done, y'all. So, I just did it. I did one right now. So, I'm trying to think. Which one should I do better? Oh, okay, boom. This is going to have to be, like, a separate video, I feel like. But y'all gonna let me know if y'all watched the whole video. Like, I would know if y'all watched the whole video. All right, so boom. This is crazy, y'all. <laughs> I'm just trying to think like of a good story time for y'all. But this is crazy. Let me drink some water on that, on that. And that's that on that. I need to drink some water. I got, I won this damn water bottle at Devon Busters. It got the motivation on there and everything. 7 a.m. Eight, nine, ten, twelve. You drink your water accordingly. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. But hell yeah. So anyway, this is a juicy story, just like this juicy ass fucking shit right here. The crab legs we want at. Hello. 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 <laughs> okay. So, yeah. So, this story is going to be about the time. I was young, y'all. I was, I was young. I'm still young, but I was younger. <laughs> I was younger, and I didn't have... Uh, the only responsibilities I had was to take care of myself. Meaning, I didn't have Kingston at the time. So, it was a while ago. Okay? It was a while ago. Okay? So, I was dealing with this dude, and I was, I got another story of time about this girl, but I don't remember the name I used, so I'm gonna just call her something else. I'm gonna call her. So, Mercedes. 
Me and Miss Addie used to kick it. And we used to chill and everything. I was at Mercedes' house and we were chilling. Mercedes got a kid. Mercedes got a little, a little baby or whatever at this time. She had a little baby. And Mercedes. Mercedes, I'm sorry. <laughs> Mercedes asked. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> she, um, we was cool though at the time. We was cool at the time. Because I was at her house with you and whatever. And, um, she, Wait, what happened? My dude caught back up. Because he ain't your dude. He wasn't your dude. He never was your dude. Back up. Okay, so he wasn't my dude. <laughs> he was just a dude I was talking to, for real. I was just chilling with him. But I was chilling with him, like, every day. Like, every day. All the time. Riding with him. I'm in the passenger seat. I'm with him. Damn near all the time. I'm like, I'm coming to he calling me to come to his house. I'm with him. You know what I'm saying? But he wasn't my dude. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. He wasn't my dude. So um then I'm at I'm at I'm at uh, I'm at Mercedes house and my friend calls me. <laughs> and he like, what's up? What you doing? Or whatever. He, he, he probably dropped me off at her damn house. <laughs> he probably dropped me off over there. Or whatever. He like, you always over there. He like, you always over there. He like, what y'all doing? Me and my homie over here about to chill like we chilling or whatever. Do y'all want to come hang out? Do we want to come hang out? So he basically t having me invite her. So I'm like, because he got somebody with him. I don't know what the deal is. You know how niggas be doing that. But. Yeah, so. He, he want me to invite her. And I'm like, okay. Like, you know. So I'm letting her know, like, what's up? You want to chill? Mercedes like, hell yeah, I want to chill. What you want? Mind you, Mercedes has a whole... I don't know if they... Were they married? Were they married? I don't know. Okay, Mercedes has a whole dude. A whole... Ba okay, she got a new baby. She... <laughs> She has a new baby. She got a baby daddy or whatever. She got a new dude, new baby, whatever. So Mercedes like, hell yeah, I still want to chill. But her dude be gone. Let me tell y'all this. Her dude be gone, like for a, for a long period of time. Her dude be gone. Her dude be gone. So she kind of be like kind of out there. Or not necessarily, I won't say out there, but she be kind of just coming and going as she please, doing whatever she want. I don't know what it was. I don't know what the hell was going on. But, um. Then, she was like trying to get a babysitter. She was like trying to get a babysitter or whatever. And it was not happening. Like nobody was like coming through for her to babysit. For her. The baby was like one or two or something like that. One. <laughs> I think the baby was like one. She was trying to get a babysitter so she can come ride out with your girl. And um, she never got a babysitter. She never got a babysitter. So 
So I let I let him know like she can't really come because she ain't got no babysitter. She can't come. Can I just bring him? <coughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I'm not disrespect, but I don't remember if. She was like, can I just bring them with me? Or if they asked, if they was like, can, can you just bring, the, bring them? You know what I'm saying? I don't remember. But, or they like, you know what, whatever. They like, whatever shit, you gonna bring your kid? They probably shocked. Like, they really probably want to see if you really gonna bring your kid. And these niggas pull up. And it was probably, it was like late at night too. It was like 10 o'clock, maybe 11 o'clock at night when they finally pull up. When they finally pull up. Um, they got the fucking, they got to put the, they got to strap the baby in the car. They got, she had, okay. She don't even got the car seat out of her nigga car before they get there. She got to go to her nigga car to get the car seat. They have to put the car seat in the car, strap the baby in and all that and all that. That took about five minutes, 10 to, ten, five to 10 minutes. For her to, you know, make sure she didn't leave nothing and all this and all that. So, um. We all get we all get set up. We in the car, so it's me, Mercedes, Mercedes baby, and the two dudes, my my friend and my dude's friend, another dude. For her, I guess. What you said? I mean, you know, for her, yeah, and. We drove like an hour, I want to say like maybe like 45 minutes out from her house because we was at her house. We drove like maybe like 45 minutes to an hour out to um, my dude's house and or where he was staying at the time. So, um... We getting out the car, you grabbing the baby. That shit was crazy, the baby was there. But she grabbing the baby and shit. Yeah. And um we go in the house. Go in the house and the baby was sleep. The baby was sleep. So we all chilling like we we were drinking and we were um kind of like just me I didn't have no kids at the time so I'm like hanging out I'm like having a good time and um um, um I guess that doesn't matter but 
we're we're just having a good time. We're drinking. We're um, having a good time. And after a couple hours, because when they picked us up, it was already late. It was like late. Like 10 or 11 o'clock. So we still up, chilling, drinking, talking. At like 2 or 3 in the morning, maybe, I want to say. So we get... So we um separate. I go in the room with um my dude. I keep saying my dude, but clearly he was my dude because I found out. <laughs> but um I keep saying my dude, but that's what I'm calling him. My dude. I go in the I go in the room with my dude. And um she in the living room with the other dude. She's our baby. She's our baby. And, um, you want to hit the streets so damn bad. <laughs> you want to be in the streets so damn bad. That's why I'm getting, you know what I'm saying? So, but she brought her baby, whatever. She brought her baby. So we still up though. It's probably like two, three in the morning. I'm not sure exactly what time it is, but, but we still up for real. I'm in the room with my dude. She in the room with the other dude. I mean, in the living room with the other dude. And I feel bad to say this. But this shit really happened. I'm gonna say it. She put the baby in the bathtub, bro. Like, the baby had the car seat. He was still in the car seat. Because he was asleep, I guess. The baby was still asleep. She put him in the fucking bathtub. It was no water in the bathtub. But it was like an empty bathtub. For sure, but she put the baby in the fucking bathtub and closed the curtain, like, and left the baby in the bathtub. Like, what the fuck? So you can fuck with this nigga, like, only now because I'm thinking about it. And then y'all probably gonna be like, that's your friend. Ah, I don't talk to her no more. And <laughs> first of all, and I wasn't thinking about it for real at the time. Like, I was not thinking about it. Like, ah. I don't know. It's messy. It's real messy. But, but, um, yeah, so I basically. How I seen the baby in the bathtub. I had to use the bathroom. So I go to the bathroom, I turn the light on, and I see a curtain. And I don't know, it just seemed weird like the curtain is pulled open. I mean, closed like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, it just seemed weird. So I pull the curtain back, and I see the baby in the fucking tub. And with the car seat and everything. And I go back in the room until my dude, my guy, that, um, damn, she put the baby in the bathtub, dude, like, why did you bring him? You shouldn't have been able to come, shit. You should have just stayed at home. But I shouldn't have to think for you, like, I would, I mean, shit, I wouldn't even... On that for her at the time. But yeah, y'all, so she uh, put the baby in the bathtub. She in the in the living room getting it on to the crack of dawn. Well boy. And 
She just had her baby in a fucking, just so she can get some dick. Put her baby in the damn bathtub. In the car seat and shit. What the fuck? Seems weird. Seems crazy. Seems very much. It's giving very much mistake. <laughs> and, um, you know. But yeah, y'all, that's going to be the end of this story time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And peace.